What is up guys, it's Bloodzillas. Welcome back to the Modern House. Let's build. This is episode three. Um, so what we're gonna do this episode, as you know, last episode we had a little problem with this upper area. It kind of looked dumb and I just couldn't get over it. And I went back and looked at the rest of the house and I realized I actually like the rest of the house. You know, we didn't fail, but um, this part is just bad. So what I'm gonna do, I think I know what's wrong, why it's not looking right. I'm just gonna delete that entire section off camera and we're gonna backtrack and rebuild a Schmeckshalicious um, upstairs that's not gonna make us cry when we look at it So let me go ahead and break all that and then we will get into today's building Alrighty, so what we have is a shape like this and actually really quickly I noticed this when I was rewatching last episode and it made me cringe a little um, This corner right here is messed up and I'm not quite sure how to fix it um, But basically you see that little space right there. It makes me want to cry a little bit when I look at it so I think if we can just go under here, yeah, we're just gonna fill it up like this. That should make it look all good from the front ski. And um, yeah, that's just something I needed to take care of before we got into this too much. And now it looks normal, so that's good. All right, we need to figure out what to do up here. Now the problem was our top half was too narrow compared to the bottom half. It just didn't look right. What we needed was a top half that actually matches with everything else. So what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna build the top half the exact width of the bottom. Um, so it's gonna go up like this, and we're gonna use some of those shapes that we already have there because you know, there's really no reason why we wouldn't. Um, so it's going up like this, and then we're gonna have the last pillar right here. All right, I think this is gonna go a lot better. We're just gonna have a flat roof. We're not gonna do a slanted roof. Oh my god, my bird just, I think it fell off its perch. I think it just fell. I actually, you're retarded. Okay, okay. Let's stop name calling Zealos. Let's just get to building. We got something like that. Um, we've been using quartz to kind of do the outside, so. Let's use our quartz. Let's figure out how we're gonna use our quartz. Um, but we're gonna have our quartz come across the top, is the idea at least. So it'll go like this. And um, let's just wrap it around. The easiest way to do a modern build is to start with a simple shapes, and then you can use them and work into some more complex shapes. But for now, we're just gonna wrap it around. Very, very simple. This is kind of like what I would do on anything, and it's not that unique. It definitely is not cool looking, um, but it's how we're gonna start. And actually, do we have any marble half slabs? Those could be... Those could come in handy right now, because I want to know what it would look like if these were half slabs. Um, which doesn't quite follow the modern theme, which is um, big squares, but... But, uh, I don't know, I don't really like it. It was worth a shot, though. I tried. Um, so, we got to figure out how we're going to make this look good. And, um, you know, that's always the problem with building, making things look good. It's really unnecessary, I don't know why we have to do that. I think it'd be a whole lot more fun if we just made everything look terrible. But someone one day decided that you gotta make your builds look good or no one's gonna watch your videos and whatever Whatever they want. That's what we're gonna go for. So this ceiling is plenty high enough if we just have it this height um, Let's go ahead and fill that in. Well, I fill it in. I have a funny story So I told you guys you may follow if you follow me on Twitter, you know this I um I bought new computer parts. I actually basically bought an entirely new computer for the most part um, I'm only keeping a couple parts for my current one um, and I bought it off Newegg and I submitted the order, right? And it told me my total, how much I was spending. And I was like, okay, that's how much I expected to spend. That's good. Um, and then after I ordered it, I checked my bank account to make sure that they had taken the right amount out and nothing more. And they had, and I was like, all right, that's how much money I expected to have left. This is good. Um, the next day they shipped it really quickly because the warehouse is nearby or something. Next day they ship everything and I, they shipped like two cases and I was like, oh God, they sent me two cases. Oh no. Oh no. Um, why'd they do that? And then it turns out. They didn't just send me two cases, they sent me two of everything. They doubled my order and I was like, oh god, no, please. And I check my bank account and they had subtracted more money and I was now in the negatives and I was like, oh, this is, this is bad. Um, so that was really, that's bad and that is currently happening. So I got RMAs, which is basically returns. So I'm going to return it and get a refund and I have my other parts still here. But yeah, that was really scary actually because I had a negative bank account. I had to call my bank and be like, I'm so sorry, I hope you're not going to like freaking murder me now and they were like nah bro it's cool just pay it back at some point and that that's what they actually said they said bro no um but yeah so that was a little bit that was a little bit scary when that happened and i was just kind of like oh my god what is going on um uh but yeah what that does mean though is this um i don't know if it all goes completely smoothly i might actually have the very next episode of this be with the new computer parts in full shaders and all that cool stuff depending on how it works um but nothing ever goes that smoothly so in all honesty, there's a pretty good chance it will not be quite yet that that happens. But I'd, I'd like it to be soon, hopefully. I don't like it on the inside here. I want to get rid of these corners, so that's what I'm doing. Um, but yeah, actually, I could probably just get rid of all that. Yeah, we want more room on the inside. So it's going to look like that. All right, I like this a lot better already. You guys like that? 
And that this weird shape I did here, I'm not sure I'm a fan yet, but I think it, I could become a fan. And actually, let's get some black glass panes. I've, I'm trying to open my mind here to other types. So we're gonna grab some black glass panes. Um, and we're just gonna try bringing them up like, oh, well, that's a problem. Um, so we can't actually do that. Well, I tried, I tried, I thought, I thought about it long and hard and it didn't work out. What about fence posts? I, I don't know. That's not really modern to, I wanna, it just doesn't feel right. There needs to be something there, but I don't wanna put a pillar there. I just, I don't wanna put a pillar there. I'm putting a pillar there. This is me putting a pillar there. Maybe, maybe if I just have both like that. All right, I'm actually okay with that. I, it's not as unique as the other, other shape, but I'm okay with that. So we'll go ahead and just like that. Lovely, lovely, very nice, okay. Very nice, all right. We can just put some bushes here for now, just cause bushes always make things look cool. All right, up here we're gonna have a, let's see, we have we have slotted windows down there, so up here we're gonna have a full window. Actually, up here it could just be a full, full window. We're not even gonna bother with a window sill or anything. This will just be your giant bay window looking out across the sea. That's kind of nice, looking into the bay. Um, so that'll be this side. Very good. And I, oh, I like this so much better. The house actually feels like it's doing something right now. Let's make a shape over here. I don't know what's going on at the moment, but it needs to be shaped up a little bit. What if we bring this around like that? Um, and basically we're gonna do what we did with the um, with the marble, but we're gonna do it in the blue clay this time, just to see how it turns out at least. Um, so we're gonna have, that's one one block higher. I, I'm okay with that actually. I think that looks kind of okay. So it goes around like, eh, I don't know, it's so weird. So weird, let's, let's delete that, let's get rid of that. Um, hmm, 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 hmm. What are we gonna do? The floor is gonna come through here, so we can go ahead and fill that out. Um, floor's going through there. We already have this weird shape over here. This is gonna be, this is gonna be a balcony. Heck yeah, let's put a balcony over here. Aw yeah. Um, so we're just gonna have a balcony come out like that and maybe it'll wrap around here like that. Okay, so on the inside we have our our lovely marble shape. We can probably put a marble pillar here. So from the inside that looks nice, but does it look okay from the outside? Yes, it does. I don't like, I don't wanna make everything symmetrical. Ugh. Such is the struggle of a builder. I don't want it to be all symmetrical. So now maybe we'll do the shape we did on the front over here and just leave that one up. I think that'll actually grow on me, even though it's unsymmetrical and everyone's like, what are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, so this is gonna come out one more like this. And um, on the underside, we can go ahead and go like that, just to make it look like it is a balcony, like so. And then we'll get our glass panes. Ooh, we used blue over here. Let's use a different color. Let's use some gray stained glass uh, as our railing for this balcony. So it's gonna start right there. All right, yeah, that looks nice. And I, I think once I get all the new computer stuff in, I'm actually going to get a texture pack too. And I know some people are like, don't build with texture packs, it's cheating. But on a let's build, I think for tutorials, I might keep it um, without texture packs, but a let's build, I'm just trying to build something that looks good. And if a texture pack is gonna do that, is gonna help with that, then I think that's okay. So I think I will use a texture pack as well as shaders. So hopefully you don't get too mad. Corrales does it guys, come on, Corrales does it. If he does it, anyone can do it. Um, uh, this corner looks a little weird. Maybe if we just fill that in there too. Oh god, the uh, the phone is going crazy. Hopefully you guys can't hear that. I would be marked down for unprofessionalism so fast. This this is so weird. I don't know what I think about this corner. Um, but actually, we'll probably just put some decoration there. Should be okay. All right, this needs to be a door. I wanna. I don't want this to be an open balcony. I want there to be a door to it. Let's go and bring this up. Oh, that's perfect. That's perfect. Okay, so this is gonna go up three. It'll come across there. Double door to the balcony. And it actually, like, look how it looks built in. Because you know what that means we can do, right? Is bushes and... I don't even know what that pillar's doing there. We might not even keep that pillar. Come to think of it. Let's just drop that down. Um, and then we'll just want to grab our fences, which are right here. Uh, we don't need bushes. And we put them there. And now we have our bush things in the corner. Um, I, it looks a little strange, but I think it could be okay. Maybe if we um, bring up those on the end. Yeah, that's okay. That is not bad. And we can even put doors in here. That is cool. Yay! Woo! indoor because I, I always go for the indoor doors um, and there we go now let's just complete this wall here and we're we're done ski which will be cool ski um, how did we do it over here we're gonna have to like do some black magic stuff this will be like a this will be a pillar right here so we're gonna oopsies that was not right this will be a stop <laughs> this will be a pillar right here I'm um, going up to the roof oopsies right there oh actually ha sometimes you misplace things and it actually looks okay 
So it'll go like that. Um, and then we can probably do slotted windows over... Oops, what am I doing? So down here we have a full window. So up here let's do some slotted windows, as in we're going to have it... How is this counted out? Well, actually, we can't really do that. We're just going to have a window that's two, I think. Because this is four wide, so there is no room to do any sort of slotted window. How did that end up over there? What? Okay, um... So if we're doing upside down there, we have to do right side up here. And you can also do... Oh! Yeah, okay, that's a problem. Actually, we're just not going to do stairs on the top, because that's a half block up. I didn't know that. Alright, so this is going to go like that, and we have our upper room. Someday, guys, I will learn to build without every wall being windows, but... <laughs> I like it. I like windows. You can't get too mad. All right, that's starting to, ah, it feels so much cleaner. It finally is starting to come together a little bit. Let's bring this pillar all the way up and this one. Um, uh, do I want to do it? Do I want to throw in unnecessary extra shapes? Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Bring that down like that. Um, and obviously that looks a little weird from the back, but it doesn't matter because there's going to be, um, we're going to delete that. JK, JK, everyone was like, I hope you delete that. Sometimes when I watch Corrales' videos, he'll do things, and I'm just like, you're going to delete that, right? And he's like, all right, and we're going to let this stay here now? I think it looks good. And I'm like, what? What are you doing? Um, but hey, it happens. All right, so now all we have to do, actually, is is build the doorway here. Is the doorway going to be made out of wood? Is it? No, the doorway's going to be made out of marble, because that's what we've been using for most doorways. At least for most doorways um, going to the rest of the house. This can probably be an upside-down stair. And then we have the door. Oh, the door needs to go on this side. We have the door right there. Um, this is going to be the rest of the house, so we can probably just put in an upside down, or right side, nope, upside down stair. Um, and then an upside down stair there, and that should be good. All right, I'm going to cut and uh, check the time, and we will be right back. All right, lovely. We have a couple minutes left. Let's just go ahead and, um, for now, fill this off, just because we don't even know where the rest of the house is going to go yet. Um, what we want to do right now is bring this all the way out to here and this all the way out to here, just so we know what we're dealing with in terms of the build. Okay, so we have that. That's looking like the floor plan of our house, except I did say that I wanted to, um, ooh, you know what we can do? Here's what we're gonna do. Let's extend this to about there, because I wanna I wanna bring this out. How do I wanna do this? I wanna bring this out um, and have another room back there. So we're gonna use our blue shape more, because we haven't actually used it that much yet. Um, like that, and then we're gonna put a doorway in right here. Yeah, that'll be nice. So we're going to have one more room just to make the house a little bit bigger. And we'll go ahead and put our lovely quartz here. Boom, boom, and boom. Ooh, yeah. Don't mind if I do. All right. So that's what we got now. That's looking nice. This is going to be a beautiful house. Beautiful house. Okay. Uh, we're going to have to break stuff here then. So let me just lay out this room and then we'll be good for um, this episode. This will be a smaller room. We'll put a pillar here uh, like that. And then the other pillar will, of course, go right here like that. And um, yeah, that is that is gonna do it. That is gonna do it for this episode, guys. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like. Oh dear, it really does help, guys. Likes are likes are pretty much the biggest motivator for me. Um, if you watch my last survival games, you know that. So thank you for watching. I do hope you're enjoying the series. Leave your likes. Leave your comments. I'll get some comments in the next episode going. This house is gonna look really cool when it's done, guys. I think we're really gonna enjoy it. So um, thank you so much for your help, and I will see you later.